And here's a product for the mind for today. And that product is you. So we will begin with you. And it all begins with the breath. So let us become still, become quiet, turn off all of the noise, television, radio, turn the cell phone off unless you're listening on the cell phone. Just sit it beside you. You want nothing in your hands. Sitting straight up in a chair, if possible. If you're lying down, that's okay. But we prefer you to sit up straight so that the energy can flow in a continuous flow from the top of the head to the bottom of your feet. So back erect, feet flat on the floor. Feet flat on the floor. Try saying that fast three times. (laughs) Your hands down to your side, sitting up straight. Closing your eyes, you should be looking at nothing but the inside of your eyelids and begin the breathing process. We will begin breathing in to the count of six, holding it for a hot second and releasing it, blowing out, exhaling to the count of six. And as you are breathing, focus on the breath in your chest because you want to feel your chest inflate and exhale. Exhale. If you do not feel it, then chances are you're not breathing deep enough. And we, you do what's comfortable for you because some people may be listening and who have a breathing apparatus, and you may not be able to breathe as well. But remember, the deeper the breath, the deeper the connection with the one, the creator that created you, that gave you breath. So if you're having difficulty breathing this morning, Ask your two creator to help you through this exercise because as you breathe, you breathe in not only the goodness and the graciousness that God has in store for you for this day, but you also send, you are sending electronic messages throughout the body. This is the most amazing computer on the planet. You're sending messages to each and every organ in the body to remain in consistency to remain consistent with your breath and with the flow of life. So let us begin. Inhale deeply to the count of six. Inhale. Two, three, four, five, six. Hold it. And exhale. Two, three, four, five, six. Remember, focusing on the breath. Inhale. Two, three, four, five, six. Hold it. And exhale. Two, three, four, five, six. Inhale deeply. Hold it. Count to yourself and exhale. Feeling the chest move up and down as you breathe. Continue breathing and counting on your own, knowing that you are at the right place at the right time doing the right thing. As you are experiencing the breath of life today, Someone somewhere on this planet, on this side of the ocean or the other side of the ocean, will experience their last breath today. And we give thanks that we have the opportunity to breathe another breath. Our work is not through. Our purpose, our mission, our reason for being here, even if we don't know what it is. It can come to you in the breathing. So remain breathing, inhaling deeply and exhaling and giving thanks for the breath, for the breath of life, for the breath of love, for the breath of laughter and joy and gratitude. Inhale deeply. Hold it. And exhale. This time as you inhale, you should be feeling the glory of the creator that is resonating through your body, beginning at the top of the head as it circulates down to the forehead, to the eyes, to the eye sockets, the eyebrows, the eyelashes, the forehead, the cheeks, the ears, the earlobes. And the chin and the neck as you continue to breathe. 
giving thanks that we are one with the creator that is divine and has made us divine in its image. As the breath continues to circulate and move throughout the shoulders, and the neck, and the back, and the arms, oh, what a wonderful breath this is. We give thanks for the breath and the energy that continues to move throughout the arms and the elbows and the fingers and the thumb and the hands as it moves down to our sides and the hips and the buttocks. As we continue to inhale deeply, giving thanks for our reproductive organs and our hips and our legs and our thighs. And those knees, yes, those knees, please keep moving, circulating, and regenerating the atoms, cells, and the microcells that keep those knees and the legs and the ankles and the heels and the arches and the feet and the toes that keep them in divine order so that we can move throughout the planet healthily. Happily, being mobile is a good thing, and we give thanks. Inhale deeply. As the breath continues to circulate from the top of the head to the bottom of the feet, we give thanks right here. Say it out loud. I give thanks. I am happy. Repeat after me. I am healthy. Oh, yes, I am. I am whole and complete, just as I am. Inhale deeply. I am happy. I am healthy. I am whole and complete just as I am. And even more, I am grateful. One more time. Inhale deeply. And as you exhale, I am happy. I am healthy. I am whole and complete. I am grateful for the energy and the electricity that moves through me. I am grateful for this breath because I am learning to keep my emotions intact. Inhale deeply. I am grateful because my emotions no longer make me sick. Inhale deeply. I am happy, healthy, whole, and complete. I am grateful that my experiences are not who I am. When I find myself in a quandary, in a situation, keep breathing, inhaling, exhaling deeply. I know that the experience has come to teach me a lesson, and I give thanks for the lesson. Even if I don't get it right away, I give thanks. Because I realize at this point in my life, my emotions can make me ill if I allow those emotions to be. Inhale deeply and exhale and give thanks. Inhale deeply, giving thanks for the heart, the brain, the liver, and the lungs. Inhale deeply, giving thanks for the spleen and the spine and the pancreas and the colon. Oh, yes, the colon where we hold many of the emotions that cause many of the illnesses. We give thanks that after today, We will learn how to clean the colon. And if you have not listened to Health and Wellness with Fiata on Friday mornings or Sunday evenings, go back and listen to the archive on how to clean that gut because the colon is where all disease starts. And right now, it is where it can end because you now have the knowledge that you need if you desire to clean the gut that holds the seat of the emotions that you may want to release. This is the beginning, and we give thanks. Inhale deeply. And as you exhale, chin to chest, 
and rotate the head to the left, slowly, 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 bringing the head around to the back, slowly. You're moving too fast, slowly, slowly, slowly just getting to the right, and slowly bringing it around to the front, chin to chest, reversing the head to the right, slowly, 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 continue breathing, inhaling and exhaling deeply. You should just be getting around to the back. Slowly, slowly bringing it over to the left. Slowly, slowly, slowly. And bringing it around to the front. Head straight up. Inhale deeply. And exhale. Inhale one more time. Inhale deeply. Hold it. Inhale deeply. Hold it. And exhale. And just be with the breath for just a moment. Move your hands to your side. Wiggle your hands, your arms, your shoulders. Wiggle those toes your feet if you can. Move those shoulders in a circular motion. Move, turn the head from left to right as far as you can, slowly. You know you're moving too fast. Slowly look from your left to your right. Look down. Look up. Take a long, deep inhale. And repeat the words after me. I am happy. I am healthy. I am whole and complete. And I can begin to breathe on any situation and circumstances that comes into my being that tries to throw me off my square, that tries to irritate me, that tries to make me sick. Hmm. I give thanks that I am in control of my emotions and my health because things only happen to me because I allow them to happen. I am in control of me. Only the creator has other control, not situations and not circumstances. And this is something that you can practice on a daily basis. It doesn't have to be. But You can do this in a few seconds, 10 seconds, 20 seconds, 30 seconds, and something or someone comes into your personal space and causes you chaos, confusion, or anxiety. Simply begin breathing. Close your eyes and begin breathing. And I promise you, if you even have a little garlic or onion on your breath, chances are when you begin breathing and you breathe and when you exhale, you breathe through your mouth, us, they may step away and leave you alone. Hence, the chaos and confusion leaves as well. So try that today and be sure and share that with someone on how the breath can control your emotion so that you don't lash back out at the person, place, or thing that caused you a little inconvenience or chaos and confusion in your well-being. And when you call in this morning, feel free to share how this experience is working for you and how you will share it with someone else. And you can call in at 515-605-9325. And remember, uh, the information is always available. If you can't remember the technique, there are other resources for you on my YouTube channel, Zelda Speaks Mindfulness. All one word, Zelda Speaks Mindfulness. That's my YouTube channel. And remember, Zelda is always available to come and speak at your organization to help with the breathing process so that we can continue to feel good. You don't need to drink, smoke, or digest anything that is harmful to your body. All of these fake substances that are that we use to help us cope. We all have different levels of coping skills, but 
the outer experiences, the digesting of, of things that are not for our well-being. You can only drink and smoke and gamble and have sex and do all of the other things so many times before it begins to become a problem with you. So just remember, when you're tempted to do something to calm yourself down, just begin breathing. You'll be glad you did. 